This past week, we discussed physical aging. Um, I really enjoyed reading all of your different posts. Um, we are a, a nation that's obsessed with aging. Um, and I think it's really interesting to think about the fact that, you know, adulthood really starts in your 20s and that aging is a process that, that's ongoing. It's not something that all of a sudden people start um, seeing and feeling the effects of once they hit 70 or 80. Um, I can tell you that I'm in my early 40s and I definitely notice that I don't have the same flexibility or abilities that I did when I was 20 years old. Um, I feel like I'm developing arthritis in my joints and um, arthritis isn't something you usually associate with somebody until they're significantly older. Does it hamper most of what I do um, in my daily life? No. But do I feel my joints more on certain days? Absolutely. Um, it allows me to have some empathy for what people who have more limitations as they age are experiencing or even people who may have a form of arthritis um, that is more of an N or, uh, autoimmune syndrome. Um, so I think it's important that we focus on those physical changes. I also really enjoy reading all of your aging simulation activities. Again, you're only tapping to, into a very small portion of what somebody experiences when they age. One of you pointed out, think about how if you had done all of those experiments together, that may actually be more like what, what the limitations would be for somebody who is elderly. Um, and then the last part I wanted to hit on is if you didn't read through some of the different um, theories of aging, um, I highly recommend that you do so. Um, you know, to answer some of the questions like, do cells only divide so many times? Um, do we have a death code written into our genetics um, for how long our bodies are going to last? Um, did you know things like having a, a strict caloric intake diet may increase longevity. You know, I'm talking about like calories of like four to 500 calories a day. Um, is that something that you would be willing to do to increase your lifespan? So take a look at those if you haven't. Um, I find them very interesting. Um, next week we look at longevity. Have a great week.